my father first came out um, to Australia in 1970. And I think it was two years after that, my mother followed, so 1972. I probably have the same, exactly the same. My, my dad came out first and then um, came back to, went back to Lebanon, got his wife and then came back to Australia. Started in 2005. But in saying that as well, you know, it's, it is a family business now. Which, you know, we've got Peter's family working in the business, there's some of my family working in, in the business. We always wanted this, you know, and, and when it started, even now, if, I think if anything, it's become more difficult now because, you know, we've got all, all, the, all our systems in place, all our quality assurances, there's more stakeholders that, you know, we're delivering to, and we're still doing, you know, we're, we're delivering those top jobs that what we did at the start, but at the start there was none of that. It's always a challenge when there's a problem, it's always good to think of a solution, how to fix it, not always go negative and say, oh, I can't do it, can't do it. It's focused, we could do it and just keep on going forward. And, it, and it's interesting, you've got to think outside the square to, to, to get there. And I think it's made us better over time. You know, the first big obstacle we overcame and then the second one, and that gives you confidence all the way that you know now Nothing's too hard. You know, we, we hope to continue to grow the business by 10% annually for the next five years. And we're, we're, we're continually pushing into the, to grow into the residential market space and the commercial space and um, aged care living. We, we come up with a strategy and that's our aim and our target. And every target that we've put, us, put for us, we, we've achieved it. And everyone, all the end users, the, the clients, ourselves, our, our subcontractors, our staff, you can see that look on their face that, you know, they, they produce this building. I actually enjoy watching the scaffold come down after we've finished a project and be happy to drive past and say, I built that building. With no, with no issues, um, any owner that lives in there say, mate, that's a good building. That's what I love. It's, it's a chamber of commerce that's been, um, you know, encouraging business between um, uh, the Lebanese Australians within Australia and within other Australian businesses and encouraging more business between um, the Middle East and, and Australia. They're celebrating the 30th year coming up and um, it's, a, it's, a good, it's a good way of selling and, and bringing all of us together, I think, as a, as a business, as a community, showing that we are doing real good. It's doing a great job too. I've been to a couple of its functions. <laughs> <laughs> I'd just like to thank um, all our staff for doing our a great job, yeah. our subcontractors, subcontractors that work with us, our funders and everyone that's been supporting us um, throughout the way.